Guys, welcome to another video. This is Vlog to Max 123. You guys might have noticed a little bit of a change there, and you can probably hear me smiling, which is a weird thing to say, because I'm just <laughs> laughing at my own brilliance. Like, why didn't I think of this earlier? I want to make a Road to Max uh, like thing, because that's kind of my plan now, is just to Max, and as you guys know, I just make progress videos and stuff like that. That's what my vlogs are. But I didn't want to have to restart from all my vlogs and then it was kind of hard to incorporate them into like maxing and stuff so there yeah, I'll just make it rename well not rename the other videos but every video now it could be it would be uh, whatever vlog to max um, yeah vlog to max episode 123 blah 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 and stuff like that so yeah this is <laughs> vlog to max I don't know it'll probably last like two videos but I think it's a good idea because then it actually so the thing is when people have the vlog some people, they don't understand, like, what it is. Like, it doesn't really tell you much. Like, the title, Vlog 123. Well, 99 Slayer for a video tells you what's going to be on. But but you say, if it's called Vlog to Max, it's like, oh, it's a series in which he's documenting himself trying to max on RuneScape. So, yes, Vlog to Max. Welcome, guys. Um, it's 4 o'clock in the morning, 5 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to bed. I just had to share this because I thought it was a brilliant idea. It's probably terrible. Also, I just got 86 fishing on my goal of 90 fishing and 90 rune crafting for the ports here. I got to get, apparently to get 10, so I have to get 90 fishing and then put up one herbalist statue and two uh, fishing statues, which I knew nothing about statues before. I put up one herbalist statue already, so I just got to get the two fishing ones and then I'll start getting plate and then I can get Tetsu. Also, there's me lovely Psyche. Also, I forgot I didn't do the emote in the video, so here you go, guys, if anyone was wanting it. Quite shit. What is that even a slayer monster? It looks like one of those uh Turos or something, like a really bad one. <laughs> but anyway. Hello. Great news, I'm doing a bit of fishing, but the great news is on 07 they finally removed random events and I can't walk anywhere. Um yeah, they removed random events, which means I can go back to the tree gnome village. Um it's great that it was so good with cutting the magics and stuff like that. But the problem was, um every time I died or broke my axe, it takes forever to get back here. But now there's no randoms. So I don't have to worry about that. Also, yeah. So I don't have to worry about dying and having to walk all the way back because there's no randoms that can kill you. There is randoms, but they give you a choice. They they talk. If you talk to them, they'll be like, "Oh, do you want to take part in this random? Do you want to go save this guy? You know, stuff like that." So yeah, they give you the choice, and there's no random that's just gonna spawn and kill you or break your axe, that kind of thing. So that's great. So yeah, I'm just fishing on Iris Street here. Seven fishing. Vlog to Max is going well. Snakey is this Jadenko? Yeah, he's been on here like ten seconds. Man. Oh, yeah, okay. Thank fuck. Alright, so I got this weird new item, some type of hunter challenge. You get it from the Squeal of Fortune. You choose what challenge you want to do in the certain one. So I got hunter thing, so I get to choose a hunter challenge. I chose Jadenko's. Um, that Jadenko is in the wall. Nice to meet you. What the fuck are you doing in there? Anyway, so you choose a challenge. I've chose this. I have to do four Jadenkos, as you can see in the bottom chat here. Um, I guess, I don't even know what you get. Bonus XP, maybe? More XP than you would? Who knows? Um, but yeah, I was doing all where I normally do, which is over here, yet I seriously spent six or seven minutes and not a single one came. Two rows of all of them just disappeared. It took that long. So I moved over here, and I got two of them just then. I know, it's weird. Like I do this quite a lot, and I always do it in that same spot, so it's... Fuck off. Um, I'll record once so we see what we get. But I clicked the other one and it says complete. You, s you send your complete challenge. Okay. What do I get? Just um, that. Right, and then I see this list of challenges. It will find your dinkos again. Let's scroll past them too fast. Needs a thing over here. Is that alphabetical order? No, there's a P there. Jadinko, Jadinko, Jadinko. Last time I went like past it three times before I even found it. Hopefully I can choose them again. If not, I'm like gonna delete this thing because no one's really interested in doing anything else. There we go. Except, yeah. So I just do this, and I'm just getting a bit of bonus XP, I guess, and that's it. Um. Yeah, I don't think I even get. Look. That's it. I think was, was it just bonus XP? Was it not? Um. Did I get one of those spinny things? Nope. So just 5k bonus XP. Oh well, I guess that's cool. Gets me to do hunting when I don't want to. Fucking Jagex, look at all those constellation prizes. Fuck. Yeah, fishing. Yeah, fishing. Yeah, fishing. Just getting agility levels from fishing. 
Ty Jagger. Hey, 89 fishing. One more level. Whew, and then I gotta get 90 rune crafting. Oh. Guys, the goal for this whole account, this Adelaide RS account, is finally done. Um, but I'm gonna just keep doing it because now I wanna see how much money I can make. I finally got the gear for Corp when it comes out. Perfect, isn't that beautiful? Zam Rocking Spear. Because prayer bonus, nice strength bonus, stuff like that. Um, what else is it? Swipe, shed, stab, crush. Okay, cool. Wait, there's a spear spec? I didn't realize it was a spec. Oh yeah, this is just like the D spear. Anyway, so I've got that gear now. Now I need to probably add like, um, I mean, probably need to make like one mil more worth of gear. Look at this guy, who's this? Um, one mil more worth of like logs and stuff for supplies, like food and stuff. And then that's it. No, I don't, you fucking, what? Oh, see what he says. Um, <laughs> yeah, uh, just probably now an extra like meal for supplies. You're rich. No, I'm not. Why do I look rich? Let's trade him. Shut him. Anyway, um, that's probably all. I, uh, anyway, fuck a meal for supplies, and that's it. That's all I need. And then everything's gonna be profit. I'm gonna swap to RS3. You guys will see. Um, We'll see how much money we start making. I bet we'll start making a bunch. Like a week, we'll probably make like 100 mil for RS3 or something silly. <laughs> but anyway, um, so yeah. A little bit for supplies and then the rest will be pure profit for my RS3 account. Which I feel like it's cheating because I'm going to make so much money. It's going to be awesome. So yes, Zabby Spear, finally. Woodcutting, also I'll share, you, share um, my woodcutting method real quick with you guys. I just woodcut like this, right? I go between these worlds, one and one through six, with the... Uh, quick world hopper thing. So once the tree dies, it hasn't died at the moment, but go like that, it takes like five seconds or so, boom, next tree. Then I just give them swap between those worlds when the tree dies and the bank's so close, and then I don't have to wait for another tree. Like It's faster than any other spot, I reckon, in the game. And then I don't have to move either, so it's really good. Also, 90 wood cutting is awesome. All right, guys, I'm about to get 90 fishing. Then after I do that, I've got a couple things to do, which is the whole point of 90 fishing was to get, um, the sea guy which helps with missions for plates so I can make tet still apparently. So hopefully that works. So I gotta set up two sea statues and one herbalor guy. I've got the herbal guy at the moment as a statue, so if I do two sea ones, apparently that will give me are you kidding me? What just happened? Did, if I just leveled <laughs> Fucking hell. Jagex, what are you like? Alright, that was weird. Alright. Fishing level is 89, so I'm gonna get that, and then I gotta. Actually, I'm gonna get dry goals. I should sort myself out some dry goals. Come on, there we are. W2. Awesome. Um, 90 fishing. Although I can do rock towers and stuff. I might do those a bit late. Well, not. Not, uh, in, not in the near future, but, but when I go for 99, I might see what that's like. Apparently, it's around 48k per hour, like fishing XP, but this can get up to like 90k, so. It depends, it's like two times the time, yeah, taking two times worth the profit, is like, yeah, is it two, two times slower XP or whatever, half slower XP, is that worth the profit? I think it might be. Jesus, look at that. Grats, 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 grats. Aha. So yeah, we'll set up this and see if we can get some plate missions and stuff. So I can't build it yet, it's not there. I've got the chef, the missionary, the assassin, and the biologist, so i got to wait until tomorrow, I guess, when the person will show up, because I've just hit 90. Ugh. I go get my dry goals. That's my plan. Also, how I'm going to get dry goals is, um, yeah, I've decided I'm going to sell a certain item, certain items, I should say. Fuck. Ugh. Reese, you better edit this out or I'm going to kill you. Um, I'm going to sell certain items, which I feel bad for selling this. Well, at least one of them because my friend gave it to me. Where is it? Um, these boots, a certain other pair of fucking boots, if I can find them boots, and then this. Alright, this should be enough for dry goals. So yeah, um, my friend November 28th, his name's now Selling on RuneScape, I think. Like, just Selling, which was actually a really cool name. Um, he gave me these mage glacial boots or whatever, so... Um, I feel really bad selling them, but yeah, I need these dry goals. Because yeah, I'm going to go do a bit of Slayer and Bossing and stuff now that I've got... What's it called? But yeah, um, I'm just going to use... Uh, instead of having banners, I'm going to sell my banners, and then I'm just going to use... Um, what's it called? That good old... Uh, War Priest gear, because there's some people in my clan, like really good people, that 
only use like Warpriest like a lot of the time, and it seems to work out for them. And I'm talking about like maxed people and stuff like that, like comped, well not comped, but yeah, um, not not nubs. So yeah, should be able to get Dragon Maces if I do this, which is gonna be awesome. But anyway, that's gonna be the end of the video, I think. I'm um, gonna quit by the, by the Dragos. Right, well that's Jagexed, both over medium, and it's not buying. I thought the shits were dropping because like the scythe and stuff. All right, so I just leave them in for a while. This is gonna be the end of the video. Uh, vlog to Max episode 123. Uh, new name. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye.